Spend an evening with Elvis and enjoy a dinner filled full of Elvis inspired food. Ashton Williams is live and Carmichael to get a little sneak peek of this upcoming event. Any chance there's bananas and peanut butter involved? <laughs> oh, you already know banana <laughs> and peanut butter right here yeah. with a little Boom. bacon sprinkled on Ooh, top, yeah. which happens to be Elvis Presley's favorite dish. And we'll get into that Betsy Height the one and only Betsy Height, uh, preparing some awesome dishes for us this morning. And you just mentioned, guys, it's just a little sneak peek, a little preview of what you can see and expect next week. So, Betsy, there's something happening in the oven. Do you want to grab that now? I do. Okay. All right, as Betsy grabs that, we'll get to her in a second, but this is Alan, Director of Development with Shriners Hospital. On March 4th, you all have a huge fundraiser. I'm so excited for it. Tell everybody at home what you all are doing. So we're doing an evening with Elvis. This was an event that was dreamed up by Shriners, who obviously are the namesakes in our hospital, and it's a benefit for our hospital. It's a night just to have a good time, watch a, an incredible performer, channel Elvis, bring live music uh, into our hearts and souls, and yeah. raise money for our hospital. And really quick, speaking of music, something is missing. If we could cue Elvis over here, that'd be awesome. Um, but here's the thing. Uh, oh, and <laughs> Alan has the moves. Um, so question to you. If I want to purchase VIP tickets, I get a little something extra special, don't I? You get something yeah. very special, which is the food we have uh, being presented here tonight as samples. Uh, okay. Yeah. Why don't we get to that? Betsy Hyatt will be catering that out on March 4th. Uh, these are all dishes inspired by Elvis. So good morning to you, Miss Betsy. Good morning. Okay. So we're where do, where do we begin? Where do we begin? Oh, you know, I think we have to begin with the favorite. This is apparently was Elvis's favorite. Okay. Peanut butter, bananas, and bacon. And yeah. I had to find a vessel for it, so I decided to do it on toast points. Ooh. Elevate it just a little bit. Okay. So, okay. And then this is a pound mm -hmm. cake that Elvis's wow. mom, Gladys, used to make for him with his very special Madagascar vanilla. So, And he loved, apparently, everything citrus. So oh. I put a little bit of uh, orange uh, peel in the cake, and then that's uh, my orange curd topped with whipped cream. Oh. So kind of a beginning and an ending. Yes, I love that. So you're about 30 seconds. Do you want to throw some salmon on the grill? Oh, I'd love to. Let's do that. Let's All right, see. So talk me through this, Betsy. Okay, so... Um, this is the only fish recipe that I found at all, um, which I thought was very interesting. And it's a, <laughs> surprisingly, huh? Glazed salmon with um, brown sugar, a, a little bit of uh, Dijon mustard, and a little bit of soy sauce. Ooh, yes, okay. ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay, you keep working on that. <laughs> um, I'm going to indulge here in just a little bit, but cool thing, we have one more segment. So we'll learn more about some Elvis-inspired dishes. We'll talk okay. more about that. Also, how about some cocktails, y'all? You can't have an event without some cocktails, so we'll talk with the event organizer uh, about that that piece of it because that's a, that's a key piece, right? That's a very right. key piece. Uh, we're going to talk back to you guys, but let me see those moves one more time. Oh my goodness. There the director is. of development of Shriners Hospital, everybody. You don't see this often. That's right. I feel like his wife is not going to be happy. Or Man, I'm about surprised that. Yeah. we can all right, guys. Yeah, be in the doghouse. Yeah. Waist up. <laughs> right? That was pretty sexy stuff. Woo. Yeah. Get it. Yeah. <laughs>